and good morning, Shafter High School. Welcome back to another great episode of HQTV, Shafter High School's News Source. I'm Crystal Villagran. And I'm Laurel Franz. And today is Friday, March 3rd. Now let's see what's going on in our general community. Students, as always, there is tutoring and it is available Monday through Thursday in the library. Morning sessions are from 7.30 to 8.20 and afternoon sessions are from 3.30 to 6.30. Students, there is a blowout sale for shirts and sweatshirts in front of the Dean's office during lunch. Shirts are two for five dollars or one for three dollars, and sweatshirts are ten dollars. Only cash is being accepted, so make sure to go out there and buy some Shafter gear. If you are a student who has an IEP and you are interested in attending a field trip to Bakersfield College, please see Miss Smith in room 412 at your earliest convenience. The field trip will be on Thursday, March 16th. All permission slips are due March 3rd today. Now let's send it over to Ariana with the weather. Hello and good morning. Uh, generals, my name is Ariana Cortez and I'll be your weather girl for today. So this week's weather, today is going to be a high of 61 and a low of 36. Tomorrow is going to be a high of 62 and a low of 40. Sunday is going to be a high of 57 and a low of 38. And on Monday is going to be a high of 58 and a low of 38. It's still pretty cold outside, so make sure to wear your sweaters and to stay warm. And that's it for the weather. Now let's send it back to the main show. Attention all juniors and seniors. If you are interested in attending a science summer camp, the UC Davis Summer Research Opportunity is now accepting applications. The deadline to sign up is March 15th. For more information, see Mrs. De La Cruz in the Career Center. Seniors, every year the Lopez family offers $10,000 in scholarships to Shafter High students only. The only requirements are being a 12th grader at Shafter High and having a GPA of 2.5 or higher. Applications are available in the Career Center and the deadline is April 11th. Seniors, you can still fill out your FAFSA application in the Career Center. Now let's send it over to Sports with Sean. Uh, good morning, Chapter I. My name is Sean Cernan and we have a lot to talk about today, so here's your daily dose of sports news. Uh, Hello, yesterday we good had morning, both baseball and uh, softball Generals. Games. My name is Ariana Cortez and, and I'll outcomes. be your weather girl for baseball, today. So this week's weather, to today is going to be a high of... Softball also had two games yesterday, and they completely destroyed East Bakersfield with a score of 15 to 1, and they tied with Porterville 1 to 1. Uh, nice job, ladies. They are currently undefeated. Boys golf opened their season with a resounding win over East High yesterday at the, the, at the Delano Golf Course. Uh, the Generals won by more than 60 shots, and it was a true team effort, as five golfers were all within seven shots of each other. Uh, junior Jared Felix led the way with shooting for 46 for nine holes, while senior Philip Wilson shot 47 and sophomore Nico uh, Valdiva shot a 50. Way to go, fellas. Good win. Uh, today, baseball varsity will continue their Wasco tournament, and they will be out of class at 1, and the bus departs at 2, and the game starts at 3. And softball varsity will continue to play at, to continue playing at the North High Tournament. Uh, good luck to all my baseball and softball players today. Hope you guys do well. Uh, tomorrow, Color Guard will be at Independence, and their bus departs early at 8.15 a.m. Uh, softball varsity will still be playing at the North High Tournament, and softball Frost off will be at Foothill and the bus departs at 7 a.m. And the first game will be against Foothill at 8.30 and their second game will be against Frontier at 8.30. Uh, and finally, Track and Field has a meet tomorrow at Sanger and their bus will be departing really early at 6.30 a.m. So I wish all my color guard, softball, and track and field people to, good, to do good tomorrow. Anyway, that's all I have for sports. Now let's send it back to the main show. Prom tickets are on sale and selling fast. Buy now and save with the Blockbuster Special March 1st through the 31st. Tickets are $75 each. Remember, your ticket includes a night of fun, food, free swag, and more. Oh, um, all students, you can still buy Noche de Gala tickets until the day of the dance for $35 per student. Ticket prices will be $40 at the door, and there will be a taco truck during the dance for you to buy food. This year's theme is Bajo Las Estrellas, and the theme colors are navy and gold. La misma bandota Grupo Anarquia and Los Reconocidos will be playing live music. They will have DJ Nate come and enjoy an evening of fun and dancing, and all the funds from the dance will be supporting scholarships. On that note, Generals, have a super general day and tune in next week for another great episode of HQTV, HQTV Shafter High School's News Source.